Okay. Let us sit comfortably. Sukhasana, Padmasana, Ardha Padmasana, whichever is comfortable for you. Roll your shoulders, make your spine erect. Palms open to the ceiling. Eyes closed. Take a deep breath in. And breathe out slowly. Take deep breaths. Inhaling the vital energy and exhaling, relax. Inhale deeply and exhale slowly and completely. Now let us chant Om three times, bringing your fingers to Chin Mudra, breathing for Om. So we give any palms together. So let us start. Since we are concentrating only on the exhalation, we sometimes feel breathless. 
So we need to stop and take deep breaths. Then go for the second round. You can increase the speed. After 30, stop and take few deep breaths. This pranayama can, should not be practiced by people who are having high BP. They should stop and take this. Uh, this is a good pranayama for removing all the toxins from our body. But at the same time, it increases pressure. So it should not be practiced by people who are having high BP. And also during cycles, we should not practice. Okay. And pregnant women should not practice at all. Let us go for the third round. And stop, take deep breaths. Let us go for the fourth round. Stop and take deep breaths. Since this pranayama helps in removing the toxins, it works on our nervous system also. And this is one of the cleansing techniques in yoga. Okay. Let us go for the last round. Then stop and take deep dry breaths. Slowly relax. Now we will start with our warm up. Let us start by relaxing our legs, stretching your legs forward, stretching your legs forward, stretch your hands by the side at the shoulder level, make a fist and rotate, one, two, three, four, five, reverse, one, two, three, four, five, and now keeping your hands either palms facing downwards or making a fist, we are going to do leg movements. How we are going to do? You are going to hold your hands at the shoulder level. At the same time, you are going to lift your one leg up, go to 45 degrees, drop, tap, and then go to 90 degrees or as much as you can, tap and come back. 45, tap, then front, tap. Hands at the same level. Okay, making your fist. Make your fist, tap. Tap, 45, 90 tap, 45 back tap, 45 tap, 90 tap, 45 tap, back tap, 45, 90, back, 
come back. 45 tap, 90 tap, 45 tap, 9, come back tap. 45, 90, 45, back. We'll do the same thing on the other leg. 45, 90, 45, back. 45, 90, 45, back. 45, 90, 45, back. 45, 90, 45, back. Then slowly relax. Then slowly relax. If you have any pain in the hamstrings or your inner thighs, just relax. Bringing your, bending your legs, relax. Bend your legs, relax. Bring your both the knees down. Come back and do the same thing on the other side. Come back to center. Go to the left. Come back to center. Go to the right. See? See to that your spine is straight always. Okay? Come to the center. Go to the left. Come back to center. Go to the right. Now, once you are going to the right, raise your hands up and bend forward, keeping your hands on the ground. Keep walking your hands forward, forward and stretch your spine nicely. Then bring your forehead to the mat. Bring your forehead to the mat. See the nice stretch on your spine. Then slowly raise your hand up and relax. We'll do the same thing on the other side. Bending your knees. Go to the other side. Bend your knees. Straighten up your spine. Then bring your hands down. Stretch in your hands, walk your hands forward, stretch your spine nicely and then bring your forehead to the mat. And stay here for a couple of seconds. Stay here for a couple of seconds. And then slowly raise your hands up and relax your hands. Now come back. Come back to this position and bring your soles together. Bring your soles together and fold your Legs, interlacing your fingers and pull your legs. Now we'll do the Kithili Asana. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now raise your hands up and bring your hands down forward and keep walking your hands forward and try to bring your forehead to the ground. As much as you can, go walk your hands forward and stay here. One, two, three, four, five. Then slowly raise your hands up and relax. Relax your thighs. Now from here, let us go to table. Let us go to table. Stretching your, stretching your toes. Stretching your toes. Now, while breathing in, tuck your toes, breathe in, arch your spine, breathe out, curve your spine, chin to the collarbone, stretch your toes. Tuck your toes, breathe in, arch your spine, breathe out, chin to the collarbone, and stretch your toes. Breathe in, arch your spine, look up. Breathe out, curve your spine, chin to the collarbone, look towards your navel and stretch your toes. One more time. Breathe in, arch your spine, look up. Breathe out, curve your spine, chin to the collarbone and stretch your toes. Then come back to table. Come back to table. From here, we will do a lizard stretch. For that, we need to stretch our legs back. Stretching your leg back and come to plank first. Come to plank first. Then take your right leg to the right side. Take your right leg to the right side. Your back leg can be down or up as per your comfort. Lizard stretch. Now bend your this hand and tap your elbow to the ground and raise your hand up. Tap your elbow to the ground and raise your hand up chest up. Then come back, keeping your hands down. Now stretch the other hand up and come down. Stretch the other hand up and come down. Now, what you're going to do, you're going to stretch this leg also up and hold at your toes. 
Stretch this leg also up and hold at your toes. Then bring it down and bring the leg back. Bring the leg back. Okay? Now, bring your right leg to the right side of the hand. Right leg to the right side of the hand. Now, bend your hands, right hand, and tap your elbow to the ground. And then raise your hands up. And chest up, look up. Then bring your hand down. Now, left hand up. Chest up, look up. And then bring your hand down. Now, your right leg. Stretch your right leg forward. Stretch your right leg without bending the knees and hold your toes. Stretch your legs. Then bring it down. Sole to the ground and take your leg back. Okay? Then come to table. We'll do it one more time. Come to plank. Come to plank. Now take your left leg forward and come to lizard. Now, bend your left, leg, left hand and tap your elbow to the ground and then raise your hand up. Chest up, look up. Then bring your hand down and take the other hand, look up. Then bring your hand down. Now, stretching your leg, stretch your leg, knee straight and hold at your toes. Hold at your toes. And lift your toes, you are on your heels. Then bring your leg down. Bring your hands and take your leg back. Come to plank. We'll do the same thing on the other side. Bring your right leg to the right side. Come to lizard. Now bend your right leg, right hand, elbow. Tap your elbow to the ground. And then raise your hands up, chest up, look up. Bring your hand down. Then raise your left hand up, chest up, look up. Then bring your hand down. Now, stretching your leg, hold your, hold your toes and stretch your leg. Heel, come on your heel, stretch. And then bring your leg down, bring your hands down and take your leg back to plank. And then come to child, rest in child pose for a few seconds. Rest in child pose for a few seconds. Then slowly come to the table and put your toes and go to Adomukha downward dog. Tuck your toes and go to Adomukha downward dog and raise your one leg up. Raise your one leg up and bring the while bending, coming back, bring your knee to the elbow, knee to the elbow, and then come back to Adomukha. We'll do the same thing on the other side. Raise your left leg up, and while bringing back, bring your knee to the elbow, and then come to Adomukha. We'll do it one more time. Raise your right leg up, and bend your leg, bring your knee to the elbow, and then come to Adomukha. We'll do the same thing on the other side. Raise your left leg up. Bend your leg. Bring, the, bring your knee to the elbow. And then come to Adomukha. Now stay in Adomukha. And come on your toes. And try to walk forward. Walk forward a little. And walk back a little. Walk five steps forward. And five steps back. Five steps forward on your toes and walk back. Then now walk back, walk, walk forward, walk forward, walk forward, walk forward, come till the hands and bend your knees, bring your chest towards the thighs and stay here. Stay here for a couple of seconds. Keep straightening your leg, keep straightening your leg with your chest towards the thighs. And then slowly raise up. Slowly raise up. Now interlacing your fingers, stretching your hands up. And come on your toes. And breathe out, down. Breathing on your toes. And breathe out, down. Breathing on your toes. And breathe out, down. 
Now bring your right leg forward and left leg 45 degrees. We will do a we will do a twisting stretch. So when when you are raising your hand up, your right heel is up. Breathe in, breathe out. Swing your hand down. Breathe in, hands up. Breathe out, 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 down. Let us do the same thing on the other side. Left hand, left leg forward, right leg 90 degrees, pointed towards the right. Now raise your hand up. At the same time, left heel up, breathe in, breathe out, swing your hand down. Breathe in up, breathe out, 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 down. Then come back to center, bring your both the legs together, keeping your hands on your knees. Just rotate, squat a little, rotate. One, two, three, four, five, reverse. One, two, three, four, five. Come back to center, keeping your hands on your hip. Bend your right leg, take it to the right and bring it down. Bend your right leg to the right and bring down. To the right, rotate and come down. To the right, rotate and come down. Reverse. To the right, forward down. Right, forward down. Right, forward down. Right, forward down. The other side. Forward, left, down. 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 Sides, forward, down. Left, forward, down. Left, forward, down. Left, forward, down. Left, forward, down. Bring, bring your legs back and take little gap between the legs, hands on the hip. Now stretching your hand back, interlacing your fingers, interlacing your fingers. See your spine should be straight. Your spine should be straight. Breathe in, stretch your spine and breathe out. Bend forward and keep extending your hands up. Extending your hands up as much as you can. Extending your hands up as much as you can. Come back to center. We'll do it one more time. Stretching your hands back. Interlacing your fingers, breathe in, stretch up, breathe out, bend from your lower back and stretching your hand up as much as you can, as much as you can. Then come back to center, <laughs> then relax, then slowly relax, your shoulders are relaxed, hands, fingers, all are warmed up now. Now later we are ready for Surya Namaskar. We will start with Surya Namaskar. Let us do nine sets. Inhale, exhale in each in each asana. Inhale and for the next asana, exhale. Yeah. Don't forget to synchronize your breath. Yes. Okay. Let us come to the front end of the mat, bringing your palms together. Om Surya Namaha. Breathe in, raise your hands up, arch your back. Breathe out, bend from your lower back to father and start now. Breathe in, right leg back, toes stretched. Breathe out, adukha, downward dog. Breathe in, come to plank. Breathe out, drop your knees, chest in on the floor, chip should be up. Breathe in, scoop up the Bhujangasana. Breathe out, Adho Mukha, Downward Dog. Breathe in, right leg forward. Breathe out, left leg forward. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Come back to Samasthiti, left leg. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Breathe out, bend from your lower back, Father Rishnathana. Breathe in, left leg back, toes stretched. Breathe out, Adho Mukha, Downward Dog. 
Breathe in to plant. Breathe out. Drop your knees. Just on the floor. Breathe in. Scoop up to Bhujangasana. Breathe out. Hadukha Dhamma Dog. Breathe in. Left leg forward. Breathe out. Right leg forward. Breathe in. Raise up. Arch your back. Come back to Samasthiti. Second round. Breathe in. Raise up. Arch your back. Breathe out the Padahastasana. Breathe in, right leg back, toe stretched. Breathe out, Adonka, downward dog. Breathe in to plank. Breathe out, drop your knees, just in on the floor. Breathe in, scoop up to Bhujangasana. Breathe out, Adonka, downward dog. Breathe in, right leg forward. Breathe out, left leg forward. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Come back to Samasthiti. Left leg. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Breathe out the Padahastasana. Breathe in, left leg back, toe stretched. Breathe out, Adonka, downward dog. Breathe in the plank. Breathe out, drop your knees, stretch in on the floor. Breathe in, scoop up to Bhujangasana. Breathe out, Adumukha, downward dog. Breathe in, left leg forward. Breathe out, right leg forward. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Come back to Samasthiti. Third round. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Breathe out to Padahastasana. Breathe in, right leg back, toe stretched. Breathe out, Adumukha, downward dog. Breathe in to plank. Breathe out to ashtang. Breathe in to bujangasana. Breathe out to adomukha. Breathe in right leg forward. Breathe out left leg forward. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Come back to samasthiti, left leg. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Breathe out to padahastasana. Breathe in, left leg back. Breathe out, Hado Mukha. Breathe in to plank. Breathe out to Ashtang. Breathe in to Bhujangasana. Breathe out to Hado Mukha. Breathe in, left leg forward. Breathe out, right leg forward. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Come back to Samasthiti. Next round. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Breathe out to Padahastasana. Breathe in, right leg back. Breathe out, Hado Mukha. Breathe in to plank. Breathe out to Ashtang. Breathe in to Bhujangasana. Breathe out to Hado Mukha. Breathe in, right leg forward. Breathe out, left leg forward. Breathe in, raise up. Arch your back, come back to Samasthiti, left leg. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Breathe out to Padahastasana. Breathe in, left leg back. Breathe out, Adho Mukha. Breathe in to plank. Breathe out to Ashtang. Breathe in to Bhujangasana. Breathe out to Adho Mukha. Breathe in, left leg forward. Breathe out, right leg forward. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Come back to Samasthiti. Fifth round. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Breathe out the Padahastasana. Breathe in, right leg back. Breathe out, Hado Mukha. Breathe in to plank. Breathe out to Ashtang. Breathe in to Bhujangasana. Breathe out to Adumukha. Breathe in, right leg forward. Breathe out, left leg forward. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Come back to Samasthiti, left leg. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Breathe out to Padahastasana. Breathe in, left leg back. Breathe out, Adumukha. Breathe in to plank. Breathe out to Ashtang. Breathe in to Bhujang. Breathe out to Adho Mukha. Breathe in, left leg forward. 
Breathe out, right legs forward. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Come back to Samasthiti. Sixth round. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Breathe out to Padahastasana. Breathe in, right leg back. Breathe out, Hadon Kam. Breathe in to Plank. Breathe out to Estang. Breathe in to Bujang. Breathe out to Adomukha. Breathe in, right leg forward. Breathe out, left leg forward. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Come back to Samasthiti, left leg. Breathe in, raise up, breathe out, bend forward. Breathe in, left leg back. Breathe out, Hado Mukha. Breathe in to plank. Breathe out to Ashtam. Breathe in to Bhujan. Breathe out to Adho Mukha. Breathe in, left leg forward. Breathe out, right leg forward. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Come back to Samasthiti. Seventh round. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Breathe out to Padahastasana. Breathe in, right leg back. Breathe out, Hado Mukha. Breathe in to Plank. Breathe out to Ashtang. Breathe in to Bhujang. Breathe out to Hado Mukha. Breathe in, right leg forward. Breathe out, left leg forward. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Come back to Samasthiti, left leg. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Breathe out to Padhastakna. Breathe in, left leg back. Breathe out, Adomukha. Breathe in to plank. Breathe out to Ashtam. Breathe in to Bhujan. Breathe out to Adomukha. Breathe in, left leg forward. Breathe out, right leg forward. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Come back to Samasthiti. Eighth round. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Breathe out to Padahastasana. Breathe in, right leg back. Breathe out, Padomukha. Breathe in to plank. Breathe out to Ashtang. Breathe in to Bhujang. Breathe out to Adomukha. Breathe in, right leg forward. Breathe out, left leg forward. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Come back to Samasthiti, left leg. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Breathe out to Padastatna. Breathe in, left leg back. Breathe out, Adomukha. Breathe in to Plank. Breathe out to Ashtang. Breathe in to Bhujang. Breathe out to Adomukha. Breathe in, left leg forward. Breathe out, right leg forward. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Come back to Samasthiti. Last round. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Breathe out to Padahastasana. Breathe in, right leg back. Breathe out, Hado Mukha. Breathe in to Plank. Breathe out to Ashtang. Breathe in to Bhujang. Breathe out to Hado Mukha. Breathe in, right leg forward. Breathe out, left leg forward. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Come back to Samasthiti, left leg. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Breathe out to Madhastasana. Breathe in, left leg back. Breathe out, Hado Mukha. Breathe in to Plank. Breathe out to Stang. Breathe in to Bhujang. Breathe out to Adomukha. Breathe in, left leg forward. Breathe out, right leg forward. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Come back to Samasthiti. And relax. Relax. And normalize your breath. Relax, normalize your breath. I hope everyone is having a um, block, right? Blocks. Yes, yoga block. 
yes just keep it we'll do something funny with that okay relax and normalize your breath we'll do a nice deep shoulder opening stretch and then we will go for upper crunches of course we'll do some more also for relaxing our back yeah how many drank water 300, 300 ml up just after getting up good varsha only varsha morning after waking up yes kavita also okay morning immediately after waking up 300 ml one cup of water one big cup of water okay please develop that habit immediately after getting up just if you want you can warm up but this is summer you can also drink as such 300 ml of water minimum immediately after getting up okay and by noon you should complete 2 liters of water that also is your target so let us come let us come to the center of the mat we'll do a nice stretch coming first in kneeling down condition okay and stretching your one leg to the right okay just like how we do parigasana in parigasana what we do you stretch your same hand to the ankle and stretch the other hand out that is what we do normally this time what we are going to do we are going to stretch our spine take our left hand on the right ankle left hand on the right ankle and stretch the other hand up you are going to look up and stay look up and stay and try to bring your hand down 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 as much as you can feel the nice stretch on the shoulders feel the nice stretch on the shoulders if you want you can hold your legs stretch the other hand stretch the other hand go up to the ankle if you can feel the nice stretch on the shoulders keep going down 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 if you can go up to the bring your head to the mat if you can bring your head to the mat bring your head to the mat which is you can you can bend these legs you can bend these legs go as much as you can down 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 stretch your hand up stay here 1 2 3 4 5 6 Seven, eight, nine, and ten. Then slowly come up. Slowly come up and do the counter. Now stretching your hand to the ankle. Raise the other hand up and stay here. Stay here. One, two, three, four, five. Then come back to center. Bring your leg back. okay now stretch your left leg to the side okay now bringing your right hand to the left slide to the left ankle stretching your hand up keep going down 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 if you can bring your head to the mat if you can bring your head to the mat stretch the other hand up Stretch the other hand up. Stay here. One, two, three, four, five. Then slowly come up. Do the counter stretch. Stretching your left hand to the left ankle. Raise your right hand up. Go sideways if you can. Look up and stay here. One, two, three, four, five. then slowly come back to center slowly come back to center bring your knees together now again stretching your right leg to the right side 
your soles on the ground. Now what we are going to do, bring in your left hand onto the ground, left hand onto the ground, raise your hand up and stretch, stretch it to the back as much as you can. Then bring your hand forward, bend forward and move, bring your right hand to the right hand, lift your left hand up. Okay? Then slowly come again to the hand to the ground, stretching your right hand up. Go back as much as you can. Open your chest and bring your hands up and bring your hands down, down forward. Then go slide your hands to the right hand and then lift your hand up. Lift your left hand up. Then slowly come back to center and relax your hands. Now let us do the same thing with the other leg. Stretch your left leg to the left side, soles on the ground. Bring your right hand to the ground and raise your hand up. Raise your left hand up. Then take your left hand behind your back as much as you can. Open your chest and look, look up, look up, and then bring your hand forward, bring your hand forward, bring it forward down, and slide your hand over the floor and bring your hand to the left ankle, then raise your right hand up and go to Parigasana. Go to Parigasana. Then again, come up and go with your hands onto the ground, raise your left hand up, open your, open your chest, look up, go take your hand back as much as you can and then slowly lift your hand up and bring it forward, bring it forward, bring it to the ground, slide your hand over the ground and take it to the left ankle. Then raise your right hand up and go to Parigasana. Stay here for a couple of seconds and then slowly come up and relax your legs and go to child pose. Relax and go to child pose. Relax and go to child pose. Relax and go to child pose. Stretching your hands, your spine should be straight, forehead on the ground, child pose. Now from here, come to the table and slowly slide forward and go to lying down on your stomach. Lie down on your stomach, okay? Lie down on your stomach. Chin to the mat and stretching your hands at the shoulder level sideways. At the shoulder level, stretching your hands sideways. Okay? Bring your legs together. Bring your legs together. Chin or forehead is on the ground. And by the side, stretch. Okay? We are going to do one dynamic movement. How we are going to do? Your right hand is stretched. What you are going to do? You're going to bring your left hand by the left side of your chest, okay? And lift your left leg up and turn and tap. Tap towards your hand. Then come back. Come back and bring your leg back. We are going to do it five times. Bend your leg and bring your, your hands are stretched, right? Right hand is stretched. You will feel a nice stretch on the right shoulder. Take your leg back. Tap and then bring it down, forehead to the mat, stretching your leg. We'll do the same thing five times. Bend your leg, turn and bring, tap your leg onto the ground. Tap your leg onto the ground. Then come back, forehead to the mat. We'll do it one more time. Bend your left leg, turn and tap your left leg onto the mat. Then slowly come back and stretch your leg. 
Now we will do the same thing on the other side. Stretch your left leg, left hand sideways at the shoulder level. Left hand sideways at the shoulder level. Bring your right hand close to your chest, palms by the clo close to the right side of your chest. Now we are going to do the same thing with the right leg. Bend your right leg, turn your body and tap your leg to the right side. And then slowly come back. Bring your leg back and stretch it. We'll do it four more times. Bend your right leg. Turn towards the left. Tap your leg. Tap your leg. And then slowly come back to center. And release your leg. Now bend your right leg. Turn to the right. Tap your right leg. Then slowly come back. Bring your leg to stretch. Bend your right leg. Turn to the left. Tap your leg. Tap your leg. Then bring your leg back and stretch your leg. One more time. Bend your right leg. Turn to the right. Tap your right leg. Then bring your leg back and stretch your leg. And lie down in Makarasana. Rest in Makarasana. Rest in Makarasana. Rest in Makarasana. These are all for the, this one, when you are extending your uh, shoulder, uh, hands by the side and doing it, it gives a nice relaxation for the shoulder blades. Okay? Now we are going to do one more thing. Your hands can be one hand over the other, chin on the mat. Okay, hand position can be like this. Okay, only the leg movement we are going to do. What we are going to do? You are going to bend your left leg. Okay, bend your left leg. Lift a little, lift a little, and then bring it to the sides 90 degrees. Okay, then again lift there, come back, and bring it down. Okay, you are going to lift your leg a little, bend. Then bring it to the sides, okay? Then 90 degrees side, then lift and come back. We are just going, lifting and bringing it. We are bringing hip movement here, that's it. Okay, bringing to the side, just like how we do it. Um, flapping fish pose. Lift, bring your leg back. Lift up, bring it to the side. Lift, bring it to the back. Then lift, bring it to the side. Okay, lift, bring it to the back and release. We'll do the same thing on the other side. Lift your right leg, bring it to the side and release for 90. Then lift, bring it to the straight and release. Lift, bend and bring it to the side, release. Lift, bring it to the back, release. Bend your leg, lift. Bring it to the sides, release your leg. Lift, bring it to the back, release. One more time, lift, bring it to the sides, release. And lift, bring it to the back and release. Release your legs, release your leg and relax. Relax, you can turn to the back, turn on to your back and rest in Tadagasana. Bending your leg, bending your leg, soles are on the ground, bending your knee, hands above, hands above, interlacing at your elbows. Okay? Now we'll do the upper crunches. How we are going to do the upper crunches? You can just watch for one day, then you can do. So initial position will be bringing your legs like this, okay? Your lower leg will be parallel to the mat. Lower leg will be parallel to the mat, okay? And you are going to keep in, keep your, keep in, keep your block on to the leg up. Your block should not fall. That is your challenge. Your block should not fall. That is your challenge, okay? Now, you are going to lift your shoulder up, lift your shoulder up, and stretch your 
leg forward. Stretch your leg forward. Then again, bring back and bring your shoulder down, head down. Okay? Now stretching your leg forward to 90 and then bring back, bring your head down. Okay? It should not fall down. This should not fall down. You are stretching your leg forward 45 degrees and then bringing your leg back. At the same time, you are lifting your shoulders forward. Now what you are going to do? You are going to raise your shoulders up. Raise your shoulders up. Come to bring, touching this, touching this. Touch this. Then stretching your leg to 90 degrees, 45 degrees. Now this time, bring your leg and stretching your hand, take your block and take it back. Then bring it back, keep it down and stretch, lie down. Okay? Stretch. Now, now bring it back, raise, lift, hold your Hold your block, raise it above 45 degrees. Don't put it onto the ground. Then bring it back. Bring your block to the legs and stretch your legs. Lift to both poles. Then come back, raising your, taking your block, stretch. Do the same thing. Stretch. Come back, stretching your leg back, then come back. If suppose, if suppose you are able to lift your shoulders off the mat and raise up also. That whether we will be able to do with this or not, we don't know. We will try this like this. Same thing, you are raising your shoulders off the mat and slowly raising up like this, up forward. Then go down, curving your back, stretching your leg back. Then come up, raising your, you are going to do the same thing with the block on. Let us do, keep your black block onto the leg. This is the initial position. Curve your back, go back and raise up, stretching your leg. Hold your block, then come back. Stretch your back without dropping the block to the ground. Raise up, then come up. Yes, with your core support. Able to do? With your core support, able to come up? Yes. Yes, super. Try it. Let me see. Yes, super, 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 Devya. Super. Super. Without jerk, try to do it without jerk. Without jerk, come up slowly, slowly, slowly. Wow, super. Come up. Let me see. Okay, super. Come on, do. Without dropping completely. Yes, slowly come up with your core support. Yes, super. Yes, that's it. Wow, nice. Okay, now slowly relax. Relax. This works on our abdomen. This works on our core subconsciously. Automatically, it works on our core. When we do this for a longer time, your tummy will automatically reduce. Yeah. Upper crunches are good for Toning our abdomen muscles. It works on our core. It works on our abdominal muscles. Toning. Now relax and lie down on your back. Keeping your hands by the side of the body. Now let us do the closing stretches. Now bring your hip up and come to bridge pose. Stay here. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Then slowly bring your hip down. Bend your both the legs together. 
Hold it. Hold it. Pavana Muktasana. Stay here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Now slowly curve your back and come to do the rocking. Rock up and down. Rock up and down. Then roll to the left. Roll to the right, roll to the left, roll to the right, roll to the left, roll to the right, and then relax your legs, stretching your leg down, hands by the side of the side of the body at the shoulder level. Bend your right leg, keep it over your left thigh, push your right knee towards the left as much as you can, and you look towards your right palm. Universal spinal twist, stay here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Bring your leg back and stretch it down. Now, left leg over the right thigh, left leg over the right thigh. Put your left knee towards the right and you can look towards your Left palm. Stay here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Slowly come back to center and stretch your leg down and lie down in Shavasana. Legs apart, toes falling outwards, hands by the side of the body. Palms facing upwards, nose pointed to the ceiling, eyes closed. Your complete weight of the body is on the mat. Take a deep breath in and breathe out slowly. Take one more deep breath in and breathe out slowly. Now bring about a feeling of inner relaxation in the whole body. Concentrate on the body and become aware of the importance of complete stillness. Relax your body from the top of the head to the tip of the toes. And mentally repeat the mantra Om. Relax your body from the top of the head to the tip of the toes. Continue with the stillness and complete awareness of the whole body. Oh. Become aware of the fact you're practicing yoga nidra. At this moment, you should take a resolve, a short positive statement. The resolve you take during Yoga Nidra is bound to come true in your life. State the resolve and repeat it three times. Now we begin to rotate our consciousness by taking a trip through the different body parts. Become aware of your right foot, right ankle, right chin, right knee, right hip, entire right leg, navel center, left foot, left ankle, left chin, left knee, 
left hip, entire left leg, navel center, abdomen center, heart center, throat center, attention on the right shoulder, right elbow, right wrist, right palm, entire right hand, throat center, left shoulder, left elbow, left wrist, left palm, entire left hand, throat center, chin, lips, nose, cheeks, ears, eyes, eyebrows, eyebrow center, forehead, top of the head, relax your body completely. Now let us do some visualization. Try to visualize the named objects to the best of your ability. A burning candle, an endless desert, snow capped mountain, temple at sunrise. Birds flying across the sunset, gray clouds drifting across the sky, across above a church, stars at night, full moon, smiling Buddha. Waves on a beach. Feel the gentle breeze from the beach. Watch the restless sea. This is like our mind. Now it is time to recall our sankalpa we made at the beginning of the practice and repeat it three times. Now relax all your efforts and become aware of your natural breath. Your body is totally relaxed. Mind has also become calm and pleasant. Stay there for a few more seconds. slowly becoming aware of your surroundings. Start wiggling your toes. Wiggle your fingers, stretching your legs, toes outwards, stretch your hands above your head and slowly roll over to your right side. And once you're comfortable with the support of the left hand, slowly sit up. Slowly sit up with your eyes closed. In this calm state of mind, let us pray and bless this whole world, bringing your palms together. Om Sarve Bhavantu Sukhinaha Sarve Santu Niramaya Sarve Bhadrani Pashyantu Makashit Dukha Bhapave Om Shanti 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 Slowly rub your palms, generate heat. Cup it on your eyes and face. Feel the warmth, feel the energy. 
Now slowly looking through the gaps of the fingers, open your eyes with a beautiful smile. Have a beautiful